In science, it's very hard to prove what consciousness is. It's, it's kind of this thing that you can't get at, you know. And so, on the other hand, we, we have it. I'm talking to you now, I'm aware of the room, and so on. It's difficult, a conscience artificial, a conscience of soi. And so the question is, can we make a system that has this kind of level of, of depth of coming to know the world? What would the poetics of this, of a neo-sentience be? And, I mean, the other kind of interesting thing is to think about this history of making an artwork and suddenly you make an artwork that you actually talk to about itself. It's a, it's a very, uh, it's a kind of paradigm shift in a way. Il me semble que de tout temps, euh, les artistes, c'est le but d'ailleurs de, de la création, c'est de, c'est de produire quelque chose donc de, de fort qui soit capable de d'aller euh, de, de vivre de sa propre vie donc d'une espèce d'autonomie particulière hein, qu'il ne faut pas donc distinguer de, de, de l'autonomie dont on parle à propos des machines this repetition of the similar but different pattern flows this building up of a body of thought this ever emergent thought body environment this mechanism of linguistic forming and framing so uh, the thought body environment the, the video is um, making you think about these processes uh, making you think maybe in a poetic way or making you aware of your own uh, sentience but at the same time, it's thinking about how do we create this new, this neo-sentience. 